All right, guys, so today we're going to look at the Binance Exchange and a couple features it has. So let's go ahead and look at kind of our order history, this tab. So we can choose what date. Let's go back to, let's say that date, all of them. So these are a couple orders I've, I have. In my last video, you guys saw I put in limit orders for, for Binance Coin, and they got filled. So I'm happy with that. It's a good price. Um, let's see, we can look at funds, transaction history. So this is how you would deposit, let's say, Bitcoin or Ethereum. Up here, you type in Bitcoin, and that's your address. You can send it from, let's say, Coinbase to Binance. You can do the same for pretty much any coin uh, Binance has. Cardano, Ethereum, Litecoin. As you guys can see, these are your addresses. And to withdraw, this is where you also choose, let's say, Bitcoin. And right here, you type in your uh, other Bitcoin address that you want to send it to. You type in the amount, you submit it. Here we can look at our funds. Uh, we can see all the coins here, but if we just want to see what we own, this is where we we click on this little button and we can see what we own. We can see the, the Bitcoin value on this side. Uh, in order would mean you submitted an order, a limit order, it hasn't been filled. It appear here. This is what is available. This is the, the number, the amount we have. From here we can go down to the basic exchange which has the same features as the as the uh, advanced exchange it just looks a little different so someone asked me how you can purchase tether so in here you can click on you click on the tab that says usdt or tether and this is where you choose with what you want to purchase it with you can choose to purchase it with binance coins or bitcoin everyone should have bitcoin of course i don't um, and you click, you would do sell Bitcoin, whatever price you want. I mean, someone's willing to buy it at that price. That's what it's in. You can sell 100% of it, 50% of your Bitcoin. When you sell it, you'll be receiving USDT or Tether. Um, the same goes with if you wanted to buy Bitcoin with your Tether, you go over here, you choose a price, someone's willing to sell it for that. You type in as much as te as much tether as you own if you want so that's how much I own for $51 and you can go ahead and buy Bitcoin with tether um, it's, it's pretty much the same for everything when when it appears here Bitcoin and let's say Cardano um, you buy Cardano with Bitcoin you sell Cardano for Bitcoin so that's how that works. This is kind of like a time and sale. So you see the orders that have gone through. This is your your asking price. So what someone's willing to sell for. This is your bid. So what someone is willing to pay for or buy it at. So that's pretty much most of the features of Binance. Um, yeah, thank you.